Hello everyone, I'm Mai and welcome to This is another video regarding Bitcoin farms With the recent changes with Tarkov and the release of the video If you don't know, I don't know what to tell you about the loop I am still very much enjoying Tarkov so Let's get on to the video This video is mainly about if Bitcoin farm level 1 and 2 is still worth constructing right now the bitcoin prices have changed the graphics cards prices have changed we are three months into the wipe I remember that you are late to the party <laughs> you already had your bitcoin farm constructed before you are gonna make a lot of money <laughs> but this video is mostly for those who are who are thinking about constructing it this time of the wipe because it all changed we have our trusty Hogwarts Legacy background. Probably changed. That. Oh yes, we have the the Bitcoin farm set up in the background. It's a, just a screenshot from the hideout. So, hello. Uh, I have a notepad here, and I will show you also the prices in time right now. So we might have to do some changes. Uh, this calcul these calculations are gonna be for right now which is 7th of march 2023 taco version 0.13.2 i think we're gonna make calculations for both bitcoin from level one and bitcoin from level two and then you'll tell me if it's worth it this does not account for fuel so just this is all just the bitcoin farm let's take account for our bitcoins Bitcoins right now are at 260k rubles to therapist. Graphics cards right now are around 410k on the flea market. There you go. Scientific calculator. We're ready. If you have a level 1 Bitcoin farm, it takes us 30 hours with 10 graphics cards to create one Bitcoin. 10 graphics cards are 4.1 mil divided by the cost of the bitcoins we do times 30 hours and divided by 24 it will take you 20 days to break even if you already have made your bitcoin farm and you are paying for your graphics cards right now that's not bad 20 days is nice that's not even a month if you haven't still created your Bitcoin farm, uh, we're going to make some calculations if it's still worth. The prices have changed over the past few months, so it might be still worth. So let's see. So our T-shaped plugs are about 11,000. Our VPXs are 105k. Our power cords are about 23 2023 our power supplies are about 50,000 and our CPU fans are about 17,000 then you have to have level 2 intelligence center that's to create and construct level 1 Bitcoin farm the construction time is about 34 hours so let's calculate the parts together. So it's 5 times 11,000, 55k. A VPX is 105k plus 10 power cords, which is 23, 230,000 plus 10 power supply units, which is 500,000 plus 15 times 17,000 that's 1.2 mil we do plus the cost of our graphics cards which is 4.1 million and now let's divide it by the bitcoin price which is 260k uh, times 200 how long it takes us to get that bitcoin and divided by how many days, how many hours in the day? 
It will take us 25 days to break even. That's a massive change since last time I did this. So let's say there's going to be three more months into the wipe. Bitcoin farm level one is still worth creating and constructing right now. So you're thinking of constructing a level two Bitcoin farm because you already have a level one and it's already three months into the wipe. What are you going to do? There's probably going to be three more months and let's do the calculations for that. It takes a level two Bitcoin farm takes 25 graphics cards and it takes you 20 hours to make one physical Bitcoin. So 25 graphics cards times 410,000 is 10.250 million. Divide by the cost of physical Bitcoin, which is 260k, times how long it takes, which is 20 hours, divided by 24. It takes you 32 days to break even if you already constructed a level 2 Bitcoin farm. Doable. Just still good two more months of just enjoying the money. And now we're gonna add all of the, our supplies to construct the level 2 Bitcoin farm. So we know the CPU fans are about 17,000. According to the Tarkov market, uh, power supply units are about 50,000. ECBs are around, let's say, 13,000. Base control relays are about 11,000. And military power, power filters are about 84,000. It's 15 times 17,000 plus 500k plus 13,000 times 15 plus 11,000 Oh, 55k. I can do that quick maths. Plus mm, 168,000 for our military power filters. Plus the cost of graphics cards, which is 10.250. And then let's divide it by our cost of physical Bitcoin, which is 260,000 times how long it takes us to make that one physical Bitcoin, which is 20 hours, divided by 24 hours, as in 24 hours in a day. And it takes us about 37 days to break even, which is huge in my opinion. That is still worth doing if you're planning on playing for end of the wipe, for the rest of the wipe, and just enjoying the wipe. And the construction time of uh, level 2 Bitcoin farm is 50 hours, so if you want to add into that, just two more days, let's say. I know that after the video came out, many people were not so keen on playing Tarkov. I, my opinion is, there's no other game like Tarkov. There are games that are similar, but never the same as Tarkov. I think they know that, and I would really like if the game could improve and not die because this game is amazing it just has flaws that can be fixed um i really love this game and i want to continue playing this game but yeah if if it just never changes and never gets fixed i don't know you might have to change games and i don't want to do that so i hope you enjoyed the video it was a bit longer as we covered both bitcoin farm level one and bitcoin farm level two in one video after the update i hope you enjoyed it Please let me know in down in the comments if this video was helpful and if you want to see anything. I really do like doing quick maths, even though we're doing it on the calculator. And I really enjoy doing Tarkov videos and Tarkov short content as well as long con content. So, yeah. I stream on Twitch sometimes. All the times. But I try not to stream only Tarkov. I try to stream other games because my Tarkov gameplay might not be as fun as other people's gameplay. So I try to do other games. I try to play other games. 
I also have a second YouTube channel where I post my other games as well as stream bots if you want to check that. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!